Hi there, welcome to Home Schooling with Hera. Hope everyone is well. Dear all, do you want your 2.5 years old to read? Do you want to develop the love of reading in him? Does it seem impossible to you? If your answer is yes to all these questions, so today's video is for you. Today I'm going to tell you that how to introduce reading to our 2.5 years old and how you can proceed any further. So if you already watched my videos, welcome back. And if you are new to my channel, let me tell you that this channel is for you. If you want to learn English spelling rules, English grammar, English phonics, and above all, how to teach all this stuff to your little ones. So click on the subscription button, turn on the notification bell, and I think you will also going to like this video. So do hit the like button as well. So come on, let's get started. So dear parents and teachers, we all want our children to be good writers. But the thing that comes before writing is reading. Unless the child has some vocabulary, unless he knows how to construct a meaningful sentence, he cannot write anything. And to give him the vocabulary and sentence structure, we need to read to him. You can start reading books to your young ones when they are even 1.5. But today I'm going to tell you some tips when the child is ready to hold the books himself and when he on his own can read the books. For this, you do not need to spend lots and lots of money. You can make these simple books at home. These are simple DIY and some techniques that we use in our Montessori environment. The first book that you can make for your children is simple pictorial. Pictorial means picture a story. Now look at this, how does it look like? You can select any theme like I have selected zoo. Okay, a visit to zoo and let's open it. You can paste different animals because we are talking about zoo. So any animal that we have in zoo, look at this, how the story is opening. You can make it this way. If I can show you, it starts from here. This is a visit to zoo. Here's a boy meeting a monkey. The mother and daughter are sitting with a gorilla. Some children are having a ride on a camel. Then we can also see hippopotamus taking bath in the pond. A man is taking the picture of a crocodile. Then we can see some giraffes a lion cage and we have a bull over here as well so these are the pictures of some animals that we see in zoo now how is it a story for a child for a two-year-old this is a story that a family visited a zoo they saw these few animals name the animals this is the vocabulary for them the sentence structure will be the vocabulary like Two boys are riding a camel. Then each and every word in this story could be a new word for a 2.5 year old. You can introduce anything through these pictures like objects in the classroom, objects in the house, fruits, vegetables, daily routine, how somebody gets up, brushes teeth, have food, go to school, then sleeps at night. These type of storybooks develop a sense of reading and also the sequencing of the events that what happened first, then what was the next event and then what was the final event. So indirectly, we are teaching our children reading and writing as well. They are learning how to sequence the events and when you are telling these sentences, they are storing them in their memory and will reproduce them at some time. Got Along with English, you can also make these stories in your native language. Like for me, the native language is Urdu. So I have made an Urdu story as well. Mera Pyara Gaon. It means my dear or my beloved village. Look at this. The theme is village. So I have collected all the pictures that belong to this theme. Okay. It's opening like this. You can see farm, farm animals a barn, a pond, a house in the village, 
and what else a family and a tractor okay so look at this these are simple stories just pictures but you can give some sentences explaining each picture and then you can ask your child to tell this story to his siblings or some other person in your house and even he can read it out to himself got it now after pictorial we have one line pictorial this is not for uh, a child of 2.5 year old rather you should introduce it uh, when your child can read a few words okay he knows some sounds because these stories are one line pictorial so in this let's open it this is in a booklet form the name of the story is holiday in kitchen this is a story about a family. Today is Sunday and Alia is helping her mother in baking cakes. Okay, Arsalan is washing dishes with his father. The grandmother is cooking food. Sana is giving food to her cat. The baby is also sitting in the kitchen and playing with a wooden spoon. And that's it. The story is finished. So you can make these stories by yourself and even you can engage your kids in cutting these pictures you can easily download lots of pictures from internet or even you can use some old books that are not in use anymore cut the pictures from them reuse them make stories for your children and enjoy this is an example of one line pictorial in the native language Taswiri or Tahriri Kahani. This is Dakia. Dakia means postman. He is a postman. Ye ek Dakia hai. Dakia, Dak ke dibbe se Dak jama karta hai. Means he collects mails from the post box. Then he also collects parcels. Sometimes he uses a motorbike. And sometimes he also travels in a van. His duty is to deliver the post to people, right? So this is another one line pictorial. A picture and a sentence, a picture and a sentence. So this is for 3.5 onwards. If you are homeschooling your children, so these are some beautiful tools to engage them, to develop their reading and writing habits and to develop their love towards books. Now this is something for four or four plus. Okay, this is a booklet now. If you want to make a booklet like this, this is again reading, but it is some informative text, right? In this, you will see a picture and some information about that, like because it is about fruit. So I have pasted a picture of a fruit and then have written some information about this. Booklets are not given at the age of 3.5 or, uh, or you can say the right age for booklets is 4 plus or 4.5 plus when the child is able to read. But you can also make fruit stories. For example, this is the story of watermelon. You can make it pictorial as well as one line pictorial. What would be the language? This is watermelon. Watermelon is green from outside. Watermelon is red from inside. Watermelon has many seeds. You can also make a jingle of this. Watermelon, watermelon, tastes so yummy, tastes so yummy. Green from outside red from inside with many seeds with many seeds something like this okay so i think this is a good and easy idea for you to follow for your 2.5 year old and even onwards even for the children who face difficulty in reading text let's start with them with pictorials picture reading picture with few words it could be a phrase or it could be a sentence Make your own books according to the level of your child. Involve them as well in making these books. And I'm sure that reading would be easier for them and for you as well if you follow these little tips.
if you want to learn that how to bring your little one towards writing so watch my next video i shall be uploading something around this topic if you want to learn about creative writing and some techniques how to guide your children how to write a simple paragraph or how to do picture descriptions so i'm leaving the links below in the description box do have a look there i shall see you with something new if you have liked the video please give it a thumbs up take care bye for now and don't forget to make it a great day bye